is since the start of pandemic there have been many suggestions about different home remedies uh, and uh, this uh, suggestion about camphor and eucalyptus oil and ajwain or uh, this is just let, uh, latest in that uh, long series but the fact is none of these home remedies have been actually studied in a, any scientific investigation so there is no proof scientific proof that any of the home remedies actually work if you talk to any biologist they would not find even any logical reason why they the inhaling this vapor of this mixture can increase oxygen blood oxygen levels if you inhale this mixture it uh, uh, some vapors go to your lung they, we can't think of any uh, simple process which can actually uh, enhance the blood oxygen levels what we have seen in the in the course of this pandemic that there are very few direct treatments which attack attack the vi or, or virus in in your body many home remedies are effective in managing symptoms as, as in they will uh, decrease incidence of cough uh, or cold but that is just external management of symptoms that doesn't mean they are actually treating infection so we if you follow some home remedy which we uh, which you think can reduce your cough or cold you can do that in the course of pandemic we have seen people inhaling too much uh, too much of uh, hot vapor and uh, getting sore to, sore throats or uh, sinus infections and so on so please don't overdo any such home remedies in our uh, modern uh, medicine placebo effect is very well known sometimes people just feel ba uh, good by uh, doing some home remedies and then just that good, good feeling uh, which they have helps them uh, fight infection better so as far as are uh, trying some home remedies concern they can keep doing it but at the same time they have to maintain social distancing they have to uh, wash their hands and they have to keep wearing masks